What's up, Yup Gang? It's your boy Texan, and welcome back to Yup the VSCD Things. And today we're bringing you another very exciting deck profile, guys. This is going to be a deck that was highly requested by many people in my comment section. So here is the new cell deck. But before we get into it, guys, I do want to say if you want to custom mats and/or sleeves, absolutely check out Pro Mats, guys. Best place for your custom card needs. Link is in the description as usual, and also on the screen now. You can see that they are holding a monthly tournament via Discord at the second weekend of every single month with some great prizing here. You can come win some Pro Mat math, TCG model leaders, and also some booster boxes. So make sure if this is something you're interested in, you use the links in the description below to go to this Discord and join it. With that being said guys if you guys enjoyed this deck or my content in general remember to hit all those buttons for me like comment and subscribe hit that bell so you never miss a video and with that being said guys let's spin this around and dive in Alrighty, you guys and here we are with another deck and i am showing off a cell deck and i am holding my buddy rod for ransom i am making him show me a deck on the channel today that he didn't even play at our locals but well, that is fine uh i have him being blackmailed so here's his deck <laughs> uh, so the new cell deck, uh, really, really fun leader. Uh, this side, I mean, pretty much I mean, everybody knows what it's going to do. Um, you stuff one under, draw one, KO battle card, three or less. Um, awaken, you get three cards under this, draw one, stand one. This side, um, second verse, almost same as the first. He attacks, you stuff a card under, draw two, uh, or android. Yeah, amazing, um, the amazing. Deck's Android, so that's never gonna miss. Uh, drop two, and this also helps with your drop control. You can drop two, give them five k, uh, critical, and KO any battle card. Yeah, so really good field amazing. control. So your leader is basically every single turn a twenty k critical. Don't have to say anything about it. First things first, going into the going into the SCR. going right into the juicy cake of the deck. We, Dang, we know okay. what we know what everybody knows. We're running. Dang, it. Everyone knows. Everyone knows. Selzy know. We'll just start off with the best first. Then we'll go to the Unison package, which just gonna be the Unison that comes with it. Uh, tested with Bardock. Uh, this guy's draw power is way more. You just need it for consistency. How was Bardock? Uh, Bardock felt good in some matches. Uh, but it's just the draw, and you have to keep KOing your one drops, and that's not what the deck wants to do. Exactly. So you know, you're not you're not gonna go out of your way to pop no. your one drops when they could be under your leader. No, and then you know the standard fun unison stuff that comes with it. The four four split. And you have oh, yeah. you have to run four dormants. Period. I, I live by f I f oh, four Frieza, but whenever I play green, now this is just me. I'm not a I'm not a, always a green player. When I when I see Frieza, I almost always throw two uh, Zamasus. How do you feel about that? Do you, do you run Zamasu? No, I in, in this design, I don't feel like that's the deck want what it wants to do. Okay. Um, I want you by turn five. I want you flowing like you normally do. Okay. And then, and take, then at once. take it all at once. Gotcha. I don't care how many he cards said, you have. He in said here. no small pokes with Zamasu. I'm just taking everything at once. Yep. And we got Absolutely. a mix of the cells the only because these guys are limit one. So if you're trying to do these, somebody burns it. When you're in the middle of the lim the unit absorb, you can't do anything about it. You're, it's done. This guy is not a limit one, but he has a few more. Like if you can only pull from hand or deck, so it doesn't pull from drop. Is his downfall? These guys will pull from deck or drop. Um, yeah, deck or drop both of these. So and then they have different come into play effects. This one. Uh, if you KO something with your leader and uh, he'll play in rest mode for free. This one, if you have a unison out and your opponent has no battle cards, he'll come out for free. They These both come cards out are rest. absolutely amazing because yeah. they force your opponent to work around both of them, but they both work to where they both force themselves into play if your opponent works around the other. Yep. Like this one, if your opponent's like not playing cards so your leader can't KO them with the effect on either side, so they, like, like, let's like say they just don't play battle cards, right? You just get to turn two anyways, play your unison, and then this guy comes out for free. Yep. So either way, you either KO a card, this comes out, or you just, they don't play nothing to work around this, and then this comes out anyways. So yep, and if you're thing. facing a heavy counter deck, you can just miss on this one, and then you can absorb all over again, and that'll just give you extra cards underneath your eight drop when you need it. Really solid. Yeah, so this, this is, again, just great, great I also, I, I also like just... The fact that you have another another copy of a different cell that that can come in active, like yep. you can just tap him for one and play him out. Just gonna pay the one and get it to go. Now the Android package. I feel like you have to run four of these. These are kind of the heart of the deck. Yes, I agree with this heavy. Um, you have to see all these. You don't have to necessarily play this guy. He's cool early pressure, but still, this guy you put him under, you draw a card. Absolutely. The other guys just help you do the awaken early. But this one, this one's your searcher, your android searcher. This one will be just your 
draw a card. This one's a little bit of critical pressure. Uh, it does have a limit one, but again, he can go under the leader and draw your card. Yeah, but that's amazing. But that, that's just another card that, like I said, if they're, they're trying to work around this effect, it just ends up being baits for other yep. things. Like, this will just be your effect when you swing and right under draw. Yeah, like that. So. full play set of each of those. And, and, the, and it's both names, which is huge. Oh, it's yeah. a 17 and 18. So if this is in the drop, you can use this as your first step to the absorb or the second step. Yeah. So very good. Absolutely. And then just some of the get negates here. I do run three homicidal. This was at four. I tested it. I felt this at three was better for me, what I was trying to do, and run three of these just so you can see it. Because you want to be able to do this on turn five. Um, and it's good to have just a nice little one tap negate if you need it. And it's you know. nice too because, like we were talking about earlier, people can play around your cells in this card. Yeah. If you do have to negate with it, you have the option to discard a card from hand and then play a one drop cell from your drop area. So if you want, you can pitch one of your cells that you, your opponent's been working around you playing, pitch it, and then just straight up play it from the yep. grave. So it's not, it's not bad. It's pretty solid. And then super combos, we're going to run 118. This card just kind of feels nice if you don't want to necessarily pull a four yet. And it's searchable, so that's okay. And it's searchable. Um, these guys will just help you refill your deck with the uh, the four drops, eight drops, whatever you need to do. And it's better cycle. Yep. You know, see more of the deck. It's really important because I don't think we pointed it out. Oh, you, I don't, you didn't get there yet. Never no, mind. Go no. Ahead. So now we're at the, uh, the fun sell stuff. These, this is the big cell package we're running. Um, so this is the card I was just about to talk about. Go ahead. Yep, this guy, amazing barrier, has his own protection, works great with the unison. You, the, when the union's activated, you're going to draw a card when this guy comes in and off your unison. So it just adds more to the cycle. The reason I was going to bring this up real quick. This card, like you said, bottom deck's great filter. Shoving this back into the deck because this card only gets a draw when you play it from your deck or hand. Yep. So you can obviously play it from the grave from, off a of union absorb to get a draw off just this, but uh, if it's in your hand, shove it to the bottom of the deck, get two brand new cards, absorb, you know, get the draw that way. Yep. A way better value. Way uh, better value. This guy you want to have happen at turn five. I tested with two. There were a lot of times where I might not have seen one or it wasn't where it needed to be when I needed it. So I upped it to three. Ratio works great. Um, this guy just runs a little off in case I want to have a little more defense or straight in the gate. Maybe they have a card that I want, you know, attacking. Uh, this guy, man, MVP. He can apply pressure. He can block. He, he just does it all. And uh, it, it, especially when they're burning cards to try to make you get rid of them and you can pop two off and keep them on board. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah, that, in that card, I, I'll say this over and over again, your earlier package. This combo stops turn two. Yeah. You literally just, your unison's out in turn two. This comes out in turn two as well if everything goes as planned. Yep. You dorm it first attack, you block it as well, you activate battle, pop two from underneath it, stand it up, and they want to attack again, you just block it again. That's it. And then their turn's over. And it goes right back to you, and you just make a whole another eight drop in the matter of one turn. Yep. Phenomenal deck. Um, they do have these at all big box retailers now, too. So you can go to, like, Meyer, Walmart, Target. They sell them all there. Of course, if your LGS got them, support your LGS first. Go over there, buy that, that deck. It works great right out of the box. Right out of the box. I'm telling you guys, it's I put five staple green cards in this deck. I put a, a, like a $30 SCR in this deck, which is sells, you know. Like, those, like you don't have to get the gold one. You can go get the normal re reprinted one. It's like $30. Yeah. It's, like, it's really cheap. Go get yourself some dormants. And like that's it. That's it. Like that's literally it. You just it comes with everything else. This deck is built for itself. Yeah. Which is amazing. You want to go over any of the lines of play because man, I I just watched you play a game and <laughs> wow was your turn five. Yeah, turn five really was nasty. Uh, turn five was fun. So turn five, um, the the whole setup I tried to get going because he had a boo out, so I had to deal with his boo while worrying about the uh, the trunks, the god ceiling. Right, as well. Yep. So I used my unison first to pull into, you know, three cards from his hand. I, I grabbed his god ceiling, thread over. Uh, immediately afterwards, this card went down, um, took him down to three cards. And on the field, I had this dude... And this dude, you also had a five but I also had the the five drop Frieza. So the I opted. I, I didn't want to straight go at him first because I was under Oceanus. 
Um, so what I ended up doing was just unioning these off and going into the Zeno, brought him down to zero cards in hand, used my leader effect, even though I wasn't going to attack with the leader, popped two off, killed his blocker, went in the first time with this guy, of course the boo blocked it, died. He had already used the effect to get rid of this cell. And then the second swing, no cards in hand, two life, game out, GG. And as you can see, we just explained so many dis different ways for turn five your opponent to have their entire hand and then have none. Yeah. Like, even, if, even if he would have stopped the Frieza or the seven drop uh, cell, we still have this set up right here. Exactly. For, for the, the, like, it's crazy. So, like, these three cards alone, like, guarantees on turn five your opponent has no cards in hand and you're going to quadruple strike, dual attack them. So, like, it's just super nice. You, 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 you either just drop him and put him to three, and then you drop either one of these and put him to no yep. cards, and you proceed to go face. And that's, that and was you, like, my you design. Have, you have a crit leader, like, so you're inevitably denying your opponent resources. Like, yep. man, this, this deck is really solid. Guys, it's a I lot definitely, of fun. It's a recommend. I definitely 100%. Recommend this buy, make sure you buy two. With that being said, do you have any final thoughts on the deck? Any Anything? I know you said you did really good at your last, like, uh, Tuesday yeah. local. Uh, any final thoughts on the deck at all? Um... It, it, any, any bad matchups? Any anything you do really good against? Uh, U7's a horrible matchup, just because they can ultimately field control and aggro really fast. Um, everything else you have a pretty square match against. Yeah. So what you're saying here? It's pretty is good. Green may be back on the menu. I think it's on the menu. All I right. think this puts it on the menu. With that being said, do you have any final shout-outs, man? Uh, definitely shout-out to VSA crew, uh, my test partners, Josh, uh, Barber, and uh, Bruce. Um, and, yeah, it was it was great. It, fun times, great deck. I had a good time. All right. With that being said, guys, this is the new Cell Expert deck. If you guys enjoyed watching this deck profile or my content in general, remember to hit all those buttons for me, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you never miss a video. And with that being said, we will see you guys next time.